Hey guys, I'm back with another video. For those of you who are new to my channel, welcome. For returning subscribers, welcome back. And for those of you who do not know, I'm paid on a weekly basis. I'm trying to balance my life and my finances while sharing my budgeting journey with you guys. So let's get started. Let's go over September. I'm not, wait, no. I went to, oh, I did go to September, but that's September 2021. We ain't living in the past. Okay, where are we? Oh, I could have done this. Child. Okay, let me zoom in. That way you guys can see everything. Everything should be good to go. Okay, I'm going to try to make this a very quick one. So this is going to go over September 2022. So the first, we got nothing going on. The second, that is a no school day because that is the Labor Day weekend. So I do it like that because, you know, Labor Day is on Monday. Um, I also get paid. There are one, two, three, four, five, five paychecks in September. It's a golden month. And I haven't even budgeted out my September yet. So I'm wondering if this is actually going to be a magic month for me. And that'll be like a golden type paycheck, you know, and I don't have to put that into bills. And I can put that just into sinking fund. And of course my wallet. I really want more spending money for me. Anyway, anyway. Okay. Saturday the 3rd, we have nothing going on. The 4th, I'm not doing anything except my um, week closeout and my cash stuffings. On the 5th, Labor Day, no school. I want to do a work from home day that day, so I need to put in my request on Monday. So I'm filming this ahead, that's why I'm saying that. <laughs> so anyway, I'm hoping this is a uh, work from home day, but we'll see. And then my daughter gets paid from her job. And then I'm also having stars. So I started up a new streaming. Um, my brother was talking about different shows on stars. I started watching P Valley. So that show has me in all different types of feels. Oh my gosh. So it's a very good show. It is not for, um, children in any way, but anyway, I started that out. So I put 10 in, I did already pay. I got a one week free to see if I actually liked what I was doing. And yes, I do like or watch what like what I was watching. I do like it. So I'm going to continue watching it, see what other shows are on there. I also saw that they have the new Outlander series uh, season out. And I did, I remember I told you guys, I stopped watching Outlander. It was just that one episode that was very, very uh, hard to watch. If you guys have watched it, you guys might know which one I'm talking about. He's um, imprisoned and um, it just, it got out of hand for me. So anyway, I passed through that, but the rest of the series is really, really good. So they have that new season out. I haven't started watching that. I still have to catch up on old ones. Anyway, moving forward, it's going to be $8.95 a month. However, because of T-Mobile Tuesday, they have a special going on where it's like $1.99 a month or something. So I'm going to see if I can quit that before I need to have it taken out for October and get in on that cheapo. So these are all due on the 5th, but I put them on the 6th because they didn't fit. So APS needs to be taken out 415, Southwest Gas $18, and then my Spotify for 15. And I, my daughter keeps using my Spotify, my double digit baby, so that's great. Okay, and then on the 7th, my oldest daughter has an eye exam and this is also double digit baby's birthday. She's gonna be 11. Oh my gosh. Homegirl's almost bigger than me. She's already up to my shoulder and she could wear my clothes and I could wear her shoes. She, I don't think she could wear my shoes. She hasn't tried it yet, but I can fit hers, which is odd. Anyway, on the 8th and the 9th and the 10th, nothing is going on. Actually, I lie. We're going to have her party on this day. I don't have my stickers with me, but I need to put that out. She wants to have a pool party, so I need to put that in. On the 11th, the same. Budget closeout, cash stuffing, nothing on the 12th. The 13th, both of my daughters, my youngest daughters, have a eye exam because they keep telling me that it's hard for them to see certain things, like far away, it's kind of blurry, and my eyesight is jacked. My son's eyesight is jacked. My 18-year-old's eyesight daughter's jacked. So I'm hoping it didn't hit them. Daddy's at like perfect vision, so we'll see. 14th in the theme. The 15th, I have two bills coming out. My fry, let me get my, I don't like doing like this. Okay, so my fries, US Bank credit card payment comes out for 100. And then I'm gonna do my first payment for Bank of America. What I've been doing is I'll pay the minimum that's due. And that's usually, oh my gosh, like 60 bucks, 70 bucks, something like that. I'll pay that and then I'll keep a remainder and continue to add and then do my second payment. On the 16th, um, that's when we are, oh, I'll get into that in a minute. Um, my Alley Auto, which is Betty, that's my um, GMC, that payment's coming out. And then we're also going to go to Great Wolf Lodge for my baby, the baby of the house for her birthday party. So we'll leave Friday night, we check in Friday, We'll be there Saturday and then Sunday we leave. So that's going to be a lot of fun. We've been there once. We had a really good time. That was her request. That's what we're going to do. 
And then one of my friends who's also my coworker, it's her birthday as well on the same day as my daughter's. And then on Sunday, just my budget closeout, cash stuffy, and then Trixie's payment comes out for 84. And I told you guys, I'm rounding around here. I think I have about 300 left on this one and then I'm done. There are two birthdays on the 19th. So my friend Jessica, her baby's birthday is on the 19th. And then also one of my best friend, her son's birthday is on the 19th. Nothing on the 20th. The 21st, um, that's when my daughter gets paid and then T-Mobile comes out. I believe it's 187, but I need to check because it fluctuates 185, 187. On the 22nd, my oldest daughter has a doctor's appointment at 11 a.m. I think she might have to change that because she works Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. She has Wednesdays off and she has to switch that because I don't want her to miss school or miss um, work. And then on the 23rd, my K-Love donation comes out for $30. On the 24th, three-minute car wash. This is a membership that I have at three-minute car wash, which is like right down the street from me. I can run my car through the wash. I don't have to pay at that time. I just pay a lump sum. <laughs> a lump sum. Sounds like I owe, well, I do owe them. Anyway, $25 for that. And then my general, that payment comes out for $289 and some change. On the 25th, budget close out, cash stocking, and then my mother-in-law's birthday is on that day too. We'll probably go out to eat. She usually likes to go somewhere. And then on the 26th, my OneDrive payment comes out. And then I also have my HP, which is going to come out. The 27th, nothing. The 28th, I have three payments coming out. Bank of America credit card. I don't know that amount yet because I have to wait to see what I have left over with cash stuffings. Cox Communication, which is the internet for our house, and my YouTube Premium. The 29th, nothing. The 30th, nothing except for that extra paycheck. And then I will also do my planning. So I have a visitor here in my room. So I'm going to let you guys go with that. I want to thank you so much for sticking with me. I really do appreciate you guys. Please comment, like, and subscribe. All those fun things. And until next time, bye. What up? <laughs> I'm just kidding. What's going on? Mm.